Do you have a room where the internet is so slow? Well, those days are over. We're about to supercharge it. Your tech, it's powerful. You can even connect devices you never thought you could. Get ready to make your life easy. Let's hook it up. Welcome to Hook It Up. Today I'm gonna to show you one way to make your wireless network much more powerful, a Wi-Fi extender. It can give your internet signal a major boost and help all your smart devices run better too. First, we'll see if a Wi-Fi extender is right for you. Then we'll look at what device you should get. Last but not least, I'll show you how to hook it up. If you have areas in your home where your Wi-Fi is getting weaker, you may have what are called dead zones. Normally, this might not be a big issue, but if you have Johnny attending class virtually upstairs, sadly watching a movie on the TV in the living room, your spouse on a Zoom call on the patio, you may find yourself with a coverage problem. If you're noticing dead zones, first try moving your router to the center of your home and away from obstacles. If that doesn't improve things, it's time to give your network a shot in the arm. A mesh network will provide a strong, seamless connection in every room, but it will also cost you more. And if you want something that's inexpensive and easy, a Wi-Fi extender is the way to go. It takes the signal from your router and rebroadcasts it to areas of your home where it doesn't reach as well, helping your tech run better. Today, we're gonna hook up the Linksys AC1200 dual band, dual band, Wi-Fi, hey! It's just this range extender. For the best results, you'll want to plug in your extender about halfway between your router and the area with the weak signal. Adjust the antenna so one points toward your router and the other toward the area you're trying to boost. If you're setting it up on a different level of your home, try placing it directly above or below your router. You can also find free Wi-Fi analyzer apps that check your internet signal and help you find the optimal spot for your extender. And if you can't find a good spot to plug it in, try using an extension cord for better placement, like on top of your Etagere. What did you say? Eta what? Huh. Etagere. Uh. Now that you've found the best location, follow the instructions to set up your extender. Next, you'll want to see if your extender is helping your Wi Fi speeds. Go to speedtest.net and click Go. Try running a test while being connected to your extender versus connected to your router. Now, if you're not noticing an improvement in your speeds, don't worry about it. Just try moving your extender to a new outlet. You may need to experiment with a few different spots before you find the best one. Wi-Fi extenders are also an easy way to get internet in your backyard, garage, or other areas right outside your home. Now you're all set. Not only will your laptop run faster, but your Alexa devices, Nest thermostat, and other smart home devices will too. So to recap, we talked about extenders and what they'll do for your Wi-Fi woes, looked at what device best fits your needs, and walked you through how to install and find the best location for your extender in your home. That's it for this episode. Thank you for watching and be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you next time on Hook It Up. Thank you.